Hey everyone, Shebim here, and we're going to see today what happens when you start the game using the Street Kid backstory. Let's get straight into it. Here is our character V. We've gone down the technical, cool, and intelligence route. That'll give us some good hacking ability, some good stealth, as well as some other cool stuff as well. So let's see the opening missions that you get when you select to be a Street Kid on this game. I'm going to do all three of the start so you can see what uh, best suits you. Now I will say to start things off that it doesn't make a huge amount of difference which backstory you do pick. Um, it doesn't really affect the long term game. All it really affects is your opening part and then a few dialogue options in the future. Um, but it shouldn't be a massive issue for you really to be honest. Um, but yeah let's see. This is what I haven't tried yet. I've not tried the Street Kid so Let's get straight into it and see what sort of action we get into. Let's go. Eventually. Any day now. A little anesthesia. The broken nose. Oh, motherfucker. Everything chill, mano? Some bastard tried to mug me. I handled it. Oh, local guy. You really think somebody local will try to mug me, Pepe? Listen, V. I got a problem. Serious this time. Find yourself a hole, sounds like. You need help? Ah, no, I could count on you. It's a uh, cork. I owe him. Don't pay by tomorrow, said he'd bust my legs. And he don't joke about that stuff. Got cartels in his corner. You in it with Kirk? Every man, woman, and rat in Haywood knows he's a fucking shark. My bro jumped the joint. Deserve the hero's welcome. I know I fuck up, V. I'll talk to Kurt. But then you're gonna owe me one. Alright, then we gotta go and speak to Kirk. Okay, we're gonna head out then. This is the prologue, of course. Was that Kirk there? Wow. That wasn't very far away, was it? Want to talk? V, been a while? Spin it, what you need? Pepe asked me to talk you up. What, he too shy to hand over the Yetis himself? Nah, tell him I don't fight. Not yet. What's he owe you? I'm afraid that's client confidentiality. Call it a lot, and leave it at that. A cred sharp with business ethics. Sounds too good to be true. Well, Merry fucking Christmas. How's your problem? Cut him some slack, will you? He'll pay. Just need some more time. Do I look like a priest that runs a charity to you? You borrow Eddie's, you gotta pay him back. With interest. It's common fucking knowledge. You suggesting I let a flaky cunt who can't keep a deal off the hook? No, you let him off, because it's me asking. Huh, <laughs> you know me. I'm a man of the bids. So I need to know what I get out of it. Transactions go two ways, I get that. I'll owe you a favor. Tempting. Got a Nova idea already. Mm-hmm. Dream ride there on the page. Only four of them in NC as of now. One, Rayfield Regional Director. Two, Mayor Ryan. Three, a rental service. Uh-huh, and four? Number four will belong to my client. Just as soon as you clep it for me, that is. I do this, and Pepe's debt is squared? Of course. I'm a man of my word. You know that. Whole thing simple. You swipe the Rayfield for me, 
I clear Pepe's account. Even toss in a cut for you, I'm such a nice guy. My man Rick works a parking structure by Embers, a club where a Rayfield driver likes to kick it. There every Friday night, like clockwork. As soon as you appear, security cam shut down, gate swings up, the road is yours. Just gotta grab the Rayfield and roll out. Simple. Who's the owner? Just an Arasaka suit from across the water. Spews cash out of every hole in his body. And his name? How would I know? Why would I care? It's a hot item, and I know where to find it. How am I supposed to do this? Expect me to slide under the chassis on a skateboard for a quick hot wire? Fast and easy? Kirk, wheels like this got security systems. Good ones. This bitty bop works like the key Rayfield techs use for repairs. Opens locks, bypasses identity authorization. A skeleton key for all Rayfields in the city. <laughs> Come on, Kirk, even you don't buy that. Kabuki's tech wizards sell more magical shit than this under the counter. Have a little faith. So, we all agreed then. We are. Glad to hear it. Always said you were a bright bulb. Head to Ember's in the Glen. Rick's in the garage. Be waiting for you. You two will hit it off. Good luck out there. Okay, so it looks like we got to go and steal a car then. This will be interesting. Although the driving on this game is not as entertaining as I would hope. Bullshit. The cabron is best in his weight class. So, so, yeah. Alright, let's head down. Maybe we've got a nice little car to get ourselves there as well, hopefully. Right. Hello. Yes, Padre. Well, who do we have here? We. Long time. Didn't know you were around. Got back from Atlanta a few weeks ago. See, you got a good down home welcome. How was it back east? Tell you later. Got something on my plate. How about you fill me in now? We'll give you a ride. Marcus, let's go. Where do I get in? Where do you want me? Oh, okay. You open the door for me. That's nicey. Thank you, sir. So where to? The Glen. Drop me off at Embers. Front door? Take the ramp, back of the bar. Show you where to stop. You heard him, Marcus. Your return to NC has been good. Busy already. And two years gone by, not much has changed. You know how it would. It has strong roots, ever watered by the same blood. Now, tell me about you. I pick up something here and there. Nothing major. But I'm getting by. Appreciate the concern. So... Atlanta didn't turn out like you expected, huh? Went there without expectations, actually. Well, except that it'd be better than here. It wasn't. Maybe it'll all work out for the best. Don't like that overtaking. Stop the car. What's going on? Business. You carry. We get a gunfight. Sebastian Ibarra. Looks like it's my lucky day. What do you want? To settle our biz once and for all. Got an offer for you, Patty, so listen up. Get the fuck out of Vista. Pull your boys off the street. I'll give you the Glen done deal. No more restless nights. See how generous I can be. One well, more Patty fucking word. Stay out of this. I don't know you. And I don't know you, which means you're worth shit around here and capable of even less. Well, anything else? 
It seems our conversation has come to a close. Careful, Padre. Never know who's got a barrel at your six. You neither, shit bucket. Marcus, please. Okay. I thought that was going to go a bit more crazy than that, but... We seem to have survived. I am pleased to see you have not forgotten your roots. Still have we here. So many of the little shits left around here. Their spines go soft when they look down a barrel. Who was that? No one important. He'll be gone in a week's time. Another will come in his place. He pulled iron on you. He did. And he will pay for doing so. Pull up here. Right here. I'll just drop down below. Here, before you go. Your number. Thank you, Padre. Maybe we can also work together again. Take ourselves back two years. Thanks, Padre. Gotta go. So go with God. Cool. Just broke me legs. Alright, so now we gotta head up and try and find this posh car. Oh. There's a elevator. Oh. Minus one for the parking, we'll go down. Kirk Sawyer. V? Status. On location. About to find your man. Rick's one of the good guys, you'll see. I trust him like a brother. Find Rick. Yeah. Something I can help you with. Are you Rick? Hey. You Rick? Yep. You with Kirk? Yep. Camera's blind. You got 20 minutes. Find the Rayfields. That looks like the bad boy just there. I see the ride. Your moment to shine, kiddo. Good luck. Let's take this piece of wonder tech for a whirl. You're a man of little faith. See? We're rich. Now fire her up and call me when you're underway. I'll tell you where to go. Hmm. There is no chance I'm making this back in one piece. Arrested. I see you haven't grown an ounce wiser. Hey, Detective Stinks. Been a while, huh? Inspector Stinks. <laughs> Same shit. Speaking of, your mug's familiar too. Yeah? You zing to me. Left for Atlanta. Looking for a slice of happiness. Guess you didn't find it. I've always maintained it's the same for all you termites in Haywood. Born here, live here, die here. Looks like I was right. You know, fuck all about me. Truth hurts, huh? Just watch your tone. I'm not a patient man. Come on, Stance. Give us a break, huh? Lock us up. I just jerk off till trial, and then what? 
Worst case, we get some months. Hell, standing room only nowadays in El Bote. No, they'll probably be out early. Are these the thieves? Fuck ordinary here. street trash. Got him in custody, Mr. Fujioka. We'll be taking him now. It's a waste of effort. I have no time to testify or play it on the investigation. Suggesting we let him go, sir? I suggest you toss them in the sea. Cuff legs broken so this trash doesn't flow. The hell? You heard him. Fuck. We have to fight our way out of this then, are we? Oh no, we're knocked out, okay. We're out of there! Alright, let's see what holds next. So we're gonna have to fight our way out somewhere, aren't we? Oh, we're not in the sea. Honestly, for a sec there, things looked iffy. Wasn't sure we'd worm out of that alive. Nah, no, Stintz wouldn't do us like that. You sure about that? Mm-hmm. He's Hayward born, bred, and grown like us. Hates suits as much as you do. Did what he had to do. That's it. If I hadn't come, you'd be cruising Night City in sexy wheels right now. Ah, come on. Job was toxic from the start. Even Kabuki under the counter magic can't get around an alarm like that. Should have known I'd have the PD on my ass. So, maybe now, as God ordained, Jackie Wells. V. I know you. You hang at the Coyote. Got the job to steal those wheels at the Coyote. From Kirk. You work with that sewer slug? Pepe wasn't big and can't afford to pay, so I stepped up. Man, gotta wonder about Pepe letting Slimy Kirk boss him around like that. Heard what they say. He's backed by cartels. Cartels? No, no, listen. I know those cartel types, and I guarantee you, none of them have even heard of Kirk. El cabrón's gotta learn. You don't do people in Haywood dirty. Come on. Let's go have some lunch. Just like that? We're gonna go and kill Kirk by the looks of it. Not so long ago. You help my homies. They're okay in my book. No harm, no foul. None at all. Getting one of my good feelings. About what? About us. Sense of kind of chemistry, you know? Come on. I'm fucking starved. Okay. Food it is. Let's go.